Hey, welcome back. It's a free event, live music, food, and more than 60 vintage clothing vendors. We're talking about the Vintage Collective happening this Sunday. We're here with the event creator Carson Deersing and film producer Daniel Wood. Guys, thanks for joining welcome, us. Welcome, guys. Yeah, thanks for having Good to have us. you here. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, this event sounds so cool. Give us the, the details. Well, it started about two years ago. Um, I run a vintage clothing business, and my buddies also does vintage culture. And um, we kind of just decided to put a community event together. And um, it's live music and vintage clothing, uh, vintage records, anything you could kind of think of. If it's vintage, it might be there, you know. But mainly, it's a lot of clothing to where, okay. like, you'll see, like, Basically anything, all Fox 59 vintage t-shirts yes. from the 90s even. This. With the Simpsons and everything. This is oh from the gosh. 90s? Yeah, so, yeah, these are from the 90s. You can see that this is like a Hanes, like 90s, like tag. Yeah, and, that was um, big yeah. back then. So you can tell from the tag yeah. what and then, era it's So there's like a series of these, so yeah. like okay. they did like a couple, Fox 59 did a couple of these wow. go crazy shirts and like oh, they no just way. put the different graphics, but Believe it or not, like these shirts are super collectible nowadays. Okay. Um, oh, I I could like, believe it. One of these shirts, like somebody might value anywhere from like 150 to like 300 dollars. Are you for serious? For one of these, because of like Malcolm in the Middle and the Simpsons yes. being on it, there's wow. such like iconic uh -huh. characters on there. Someone um, at home is like, I know I got one of those in a drawer. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> bring it out Sunday and come bring it for a trade, or somebody might yeah. even get it off you, but. This is also another product that we'll be having out there. It's a community event, like I said, so the Vintage Collective works with a lot of like, uh, I guess local companies and designers and stuff like okay. that. So this is a local company out of um, Bloomington, Indiana called Gonzo Hydraulica. Okay. And they helped us make our own t-shirt for the event this year. Yeah. So all the proceeds for the shirts that sell go for the live music. So that's great. Right. Um, like I said, like we try to make it a community event and just Look out for everybody. Yeah, it's happening May 22nd from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. in Bogstown Park. I, admittedly, I had to look up where Bogstown was. I oh, mean, yeah. Wh where's Bogstown for someone who, who may not know? It's kind of out in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. So it's a nice drive down a like a country road, but it's really fun to go out to. We have a bunch of videos on our YouTube, uh, new production, worth checking out before you come out to the event to see what you're getting yourself into, but it's a really fun time out there at the event. It's awesome. It looks nice. like a lot of fun. Too. What does your shirt say right here? What's it say? Sometimes clothing. Sometimes clothing be speaking be to you. Be speaking to you. <laughs> yeah, so this is one of his actually shirts that he makes for his company. He does like collection videos. So oh, like, that's awesome. like I said, we're into like the community. So like we try to do anything like with our passions to like showcase like vintage yeah. clothing. Yeah. yeah. That's amazing. Um, I know people are going to want to know more information about this and about the Vintage Collective. So give us the details on how where they can find you guys. Well, you can find us uh, at the Vintage Collective underscore Flea on Instagram. Okay. Um, that's where I make all the updates for everything. I keep everybody posted on there. Um, we also have a, a website where you can look up just the collective and my business, staytunedvintage.com. Um, and then also, if you just want to check out like the past event videos, we capture like the whole thing, like okay. the music, the interviews, everything about it, the vibe. We try to capture that for the online presence. So that's on YouTube as well with uh, new productions on YouTube. And then the last thing, we have these posters hung up around the city. So check yeah, these out. Yep. So if you maybe you guys maybe seen some of these in Fountain Square or Broad Ripple, but they're every we tried to put them everywhere. Oh, that is great. <laughs> I love the, the Campbell soup look <laughs> over here. Gentlemen, thank you so much. This event sounds like a ton of fun. We appreciate it. We have all the information right there for you guys.